psychological significance of the belly. It's the descent into the dark. Jonah in the whale. I mean, that's that's a standard motif of going into the whale's belly and coming out again. Why must the hero do that? The whale represents the uh, personification, you might say, of all that is in the unconscious. Psych in reading these things psychologically, water is the unconscious. The creature in the water would be the dynamism of the unconscious, which is, is dangerous and powerful and has to be uh, controlled by consciousness. The first stage in the uh, hero adventure, when he starts off on adventure, is leaving the realm of light, which he controls and knows about, and moving toward the, uh, the threshold. And it's at the threshold that the monster of the abyss comes to meet him. And then there are two or three results. One, the hero is cut to pieces and descends into the abyss in fragments to be resurrected. Or he may kill the dragon power, as Siegfried does when he kills the dragon. But then he takes the dragon blood, that's say he has to assimilate that power. And when Siegfried has killed the dragon <coughs> and tasted the blood, he hears the song of nature. He has transcended his humanity, you know, and uh, re-associated uh, uh, himself with the powers of nature, which are the powers of our, of our life, from which our mind removes us. You see, this thing up here, this consciousness thinks it's running the shop. It's a secondary organ. It's a secondary organ of a, of a total human being, and it must not put itself in control. It must submit and serve the humanity of the body. Join me, and I will complete your training. When it does put itself in control, you get this father, the man who's gone over to the intellectual side. I'll never join you! If you only knew the power of the dark side. He isn't thinking in, in, or living in terms of humanity. He's living in terms of a system. And this is the threat to our lives. We all face it. We all operate in our society in relation to a system. Now, is the system going to eat you up and re uh, relieve you of your humanity? Or are you going to be able to use the system to human purposes? Would the hero with a thousand faces help us to answer that question about how to change the system so that we are not serving it? I don't think it would help you. To